How to serialize SQA Alchemy result to JSON? Django has some good automatic serialization of on models returned from DB to JSON format. How to serialize SQA Alchemy query result to JSON format? I tried typical.encode but it encodes query object itself. I tried json.dumps items but it returns. Is it really so hard to serialize SQA Alchemy on objects to JSON slash XML? Isn't there any default serializer for it? It's very common task to serialize on query results nowadays. What I need is just to return JSON or XML data representation of SQA Alchemy query result. Sklalchemy objects query result in JSON slash XML format is needed to be used in JavaScript data good, grid, this URL. A flat implementation. You could use something like this. and then convert to JSON using. It will ignore fields that are not encodable, set them to none. It doesn't auto-expand relations, since this could lead to self-references, and loop forever. A recursive, non-circular implementation. If, however, you'd rather loop forever, you could use and then encode objects using. This would encode all children, and all their children, and all their children. Potentially encode your entire database, basically. When it reaches something it's encoded before, it will encode it as none. A recursive, possibly circular, selective implementation. Another alternative, probably better, is to be able to specify the fields you want to expand, You can now call it with to only expand SQL alchemy fields called parents, for example. You could just output your object as a dictionary. And then you use user dot as underscore dict to serialize your object. As explained in convert SQL alchemy row object to Python dict. Python 3.7 plus and Flask 1.1 plus can use the built-in data classes package.
the slash user slash route will now return a list of users. Auto serialize related models. The response from JSONify account would be this. Overwrite the default JSON encoder. You can convert a raw proxy to a dict like this. Then serialize that to JSON, you will have to specify an encoder for things like datetime values, it's not that hard if you just want one record, and not a full hierarchy of related records. If you want to see more, please consider subscribing.